everyone i am sunil pudar today video is on divisibility let's begin here i am going to tell you about division approximate method here we use base method means it can it will be divisible over 10 it is a multiplication of 10 or 100 in denominator in division the upper one is always known as it is called numerator the below one is known as denominator so what we are going to do in division approx method we are getting figure nearby actual figure I want to illustrate an example here like when we divide a number numerator upon denominator point nine four is the exact answer or actual figure if it is actual figure we will try to get the answer just like that one with a little modification a little change so we want approx or nearby figure like two eight nine or two point nine three because the point one or point zero zero one the difference we want in our answers that is approx to the actual figure so let's start i am going to discuss three types with you here the first one is type one where or we also called is a positive plus base let's take an example here we have to divide 7 85 with 69 or we also write it as 7 85 upon 69 the above one is the numerator the down one is denominator so i told you we use going to use base by to which number 785 is nearby to 800 and 69 is nearby to 70 write it here 69 is nearby to 70 so this is the plus one 800 divided by 70 11.4 that is per unit unit down for one unit the value is 11.4 this is the nearby figure so what we are going to do 785 is our numerator we have to divide with 69 once the addition concept so we, we add 1 and as I told per unit for each unit we have 11.4 means for 1 we have 11.4 is the exact value so we will multiply 11.4 with the numerator then we will divide with 70 as we already added this one plus 1 so means denominator we need to keep 
as a multiple of 10. 785 plus 11.4 we have to add. Answer will come out 196.4 divided by 7. 11.44. It is our approx figure. Let's check what the answer will come out when we calculate 785 divided by 16. I will come to know that it is 11.428. This is our actual figure and this is our approx figure. You noted it. Begin with type 2 negative base method. Let's take an example here. As we done with two digit denominator in type 1, now we will begin with three digit division concept where denominator will be three digit and the numerator will be greater than three digit. Now, here numerator is more in digits than denominator. We have access plus 2. So to reach the numerator or to keep the numerator in multiple of 10, we use the negative base method means negative multiple of 10. 4 to 0 around 4 to 100. And I keep 7 0 to minus 2 concept here. We have to divide 4 to 0 0. 7 0 to minus 2 is 700. So our answer is per unit value is 6. Dividing this we will get 6. That is our per unit value. 4 to 0 2. As we already subtracted the minus 2. So we will use the negative concept here. Negative as we subtract it to make it it multiple of 100 we will multiply per unit value that is 6 and we will keep the denominators as base because we are using the base concept here now 4202 minus 12 4190 so our answer 5.2 9 8 this is our approx figure let's check the exact answer when we divide 4202 with 702 so the actual figure is 5.98 the exact answer we have there note it down for your future use the plus base is our type 1. The negative base is our type 2. Now I am going to discuss the long division it will be around 5 or the numerator will be a longer one that is 8, 7 digit. So let's discuss how type 3 large digit division. Let's take an example here 6, 8, 9. 4, 3, 8, 1 with 7, 2, 8, 1, 0, 1. Here we have to divide that digit, that long digit with that long digit. I will tell you a method so that we get nearly or approx answer as we neglected from numerator we also have to neglect same last three digit from numerator means 381 we have to neglect we have to divide 6894 with 728 let's check as we already done this in type 2 the negative base to nearby to 6900 6 1900 and 728 in multiple of hundreds it is nearby to 700 but to make it 700 we have to minus 28 
from 728 means for 1 upon 700 for one unit we have 9.85 value as we have subtracted minus 28 here to make it 700 first we have to keep 6 8 9 4 here and the base 700 as it is easy to do by the base concept now minus 28 as we have subtracted to make it 700 720 and multiply it per unit value that is our 9.85 on solving the numerator 6894 minus Two seven four point four upon seven hundred six six one nine point six upon seven hundred. After solving this, we will divide six six one nine with seven. The answer will come out nine. 0.456 always keep the thousand separate and because it is easy to divide 66196 six, with 7 when you get the answer you will use your decimal method and take the decimal to the number where it is required our approx answer is 9.456 let's check with the actual answer when you divide 6894381 with 72801 the actual figure you will get is 9.468 so that is near to approx 9.456 only the 0 0.001 difference is there